When you look at, obviously, what happened here in, in your country with Brexit, why do you think this is the time for both countries? Why do you think people are now sharing their voice at the level they're sharing it? I think it's got it's a culmination of the perfect sort of storm. You've got a situation where after the 2008 financial world economic breakdown, you set up a situation where people in the last seven, eight years haven't felt an ounce of difference in their lives for the better. So you've got that. Then you've got 65 million people who are fleeing war-torn nations, wars that started about six, seven years ago, um, flooding into Europe, flooding into America, wherever else it might be, to seek refuge from horrific situations. I know, I was born in one. Um, and at the same time, you've got the media, you know, the industry you and I work in, Arthur, who are perhaps being very nonchalant about the way that we represent these ideas, maybe giving too much airtime to some voices and opinions that are hateful. So you get this perfect storm of all of these things wrong. And I understand why you would be scared, but for goodness sake people put your fear in the right bloody basket it's not the immigrants okay like just think about it rationally